Hey there, Facebook family. We are back. I had to take a quick break, y'all. Sorry, I am 15 minutes late again, but I, I had to grab a bite to eat and just compose myself. I didn't put enough breaks in between this all day thing, but we are three hours in, 12 hours to go. So come on, come on, come on in. We're going until midnight tonight, showing you some fabulous $5 jewelry. Come on in. We're going to play some 70s trivia this hour and the way that you engage is I will ask a question and the first person to provide the answer will earn a point at the end of the show the person with the most points on Facebook Instagram and YouTube hey Lene welcome back girl the first person that earns the point I mean the person that earns the most points y'all I'm just three hours in what am I gonna be like by six or nine o'clock tonight <laughs> But the person that earns the most points will win a fabulous prize. So this hour, y'all, I am showing you some beautiful pieces in green, red, orange, yellow, and blue. We got all the bright colors, the colors of the 70s, the colors I remember anyway. So come on in. We're going to look at some great items. And the way that you engage is I will show you an item with an item number. Oops. With an item number. And you select that item uh, by saying, I'll take number 70. And if it's a set and you don't want the whole set, you can say number 70 necklace, number 70 bracelet. You can order individual pieces. You do not have to purchase the whole set. Most of the items I'm going to show this hour are $5. Um, I will occasionally throw in some of our Z collection, which I am showing behind me. These are $25 pieces. And then um, I have not so far because I've, just gotten lost in the um, in the show, but I will try to show some kids jewelry this hour. Some one dollar kids items. I, all of our kids items are one dollar. If you do not see something that you're interested in, check out my website www.tlc's body bling. That's tlcs body bling .com. All right, we are going to get started with a gorgeous pair of green earrings, y'all. These are super cute. These are called dipped earrings, and these earrings um, are absolutely gorgeous. What happens is at the top, they are white, and, and they transition to another color. These are actually, these actually transition to green. Let me kind of get these strands straight here. Take a look at those, y'all. Super cute, white. They transition to green. They are absolutely gorgeous. You can see the length on those. Cute, cute, cute. They're on silver hardware. These are posted earrings. Super cute in green and in white. Take a look at those. Gorgeous in green and white. If you want to grab those, you can comment. Number 70 for me. Number 70 in green and in white. These are absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous in green. The next pair of earrings I'm going to show you, and I also have this particular pair in black as well, are a pair of red leather earrings, y'all. Red leather earrings. And I thought I had, let's see, I must have put it away. I had a red leather bracelet that would be super cute with these as well. But I'll go ahead and show you these. These are some leather earrings in red. Super cute. Take a look at those. They have that woven pattern. Again, I also have these in black. Gorgeous in red. And these are going to be number 147. Number 147. Hey, Rita. Thanks for joining. Hey, Tiffany. I'm glad you came back. I got some kid stuff on deck to show. Check it out, number 147. These are red leather woven earrings, number 147. Super cute. I have several pair of those. So this hour, guys, it is our 70s trivia hour. And um, we're going to show red, orange, yellow, green, and blue, and some yellows. Trying to keep it the bright 70s color. So come on in. 
grab you something to drink, get ready to look at some absolutely gorgeous stuff. I told, I was just telling everybody earlier, um, I'm only three hours in and um, I don't know what I'm gonna be like by six o'clock tonight or nine o'clock tonight, let alone midnight, but we got 12 hours to go, y'all. We counting it down, so come on in. I got something weird going on on Instagram. Give me one second, guys. Let me see what this thing is telling me. Oh, it didn't like the fact my post was too long. Give me one second, guys. I got something that I don't know. I'm not a huge Instagram user, so y'all, this is fairly new to me. But I tell you, it coordinating this was very interesting. There we go. Let's see if that works. I hope it's working. It's, my live button's on. We're just going to assume it's working. Maybe somebody will join shortly and drink plenty of coffee, girl. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need more than some coffee because <laughs> I didn't count on I thought 30 minutes between was a good enough break. Mm -mm, I should have did on an hour, off an hour, on an hour, off an hour. But anyway, we're going to make it work, y'all. So our first 70s trivia question is, I'm going to ask you a question. And the first person to comment that I see on my side, and I'm looking at all three chats here, the first person that comments earns the point. At the end of the show, the person with the most points will win a fabulous piece of free jewelry. So, the first question is, who used to beg customers, please don't squeeze the Charmin? So, I'm going to show you guys these gorgeous earrings, and I have these in both yellow and in orange. They are absolutely cute. The yellow ones are on silver hardware and the orange ones are on gold hardware. Not Charlie, Lene. Take a look at these, y'all. Super cute in yellow. Let's see. I thought I brought. I got my green. Did I leave my orange out there? Oh, right here. Duh. <laughs> Who used to beg customers, please do not squeeze the Charmin? Okay, surely I'm not the only one who remember the 70s, y'all. Come on in here. Check these out, y'all. Mr. Whipple, you got it, Rita. Rita earned the point. That was Mr. Whipple who used to say. Mr. Whipple had the little mustache and he dressed in white, wore a little black bow tie if, I, if my memory is good. And he used to say, please do not squeeze the, sh the Charmin. So Rita earns that point. Take a look at these, y'all. Again, the orange pair is on gold hardware and the gold pair is on silver hardware. Take a look at those. Super cute. Super cute. This is going to be number 177. Number 177. You like these earrings and you want both pair, you can just say 177 set. If you just like the orange pair, comment 177 orange. You just like the yellow comment 177 yellow or gold. Super cute in orange and yellow. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Number 177. Let me write down Rita's point so I don't lose track of that. 177 in yellow and 177 in orange.
See, y'all, my little desk was already crowded when I just had my computer on here. I got my computer, my tablet, and my phone all going at the same time. So, 70s trivia. Rita earned the first point. All right, Rita. All right, so let's look at something in blue, y'all. This cute, cute necklace. And I'm wondering I was going to say, I thought I had one of these already open. Let me do this right quick, y'all. I am not completely losing my memory. Let's see. Isn't cute? Yeah, we played Blingo last hour, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah, this is this will work. So this next necklace I'm going to show you is a longer blue necklace. Take a look at these super cute blue earrings. I think my chair has shifted a little bit. Probably when I ran out of here to get something to eat, y'all, I was so hungry. I've been going since about 7 this morning. Take a look at those cute blue complimentary coordinating earrings. <clears throat> So guys, all paparazzi necklaces comes with, ladies necklaces come with complimentary coordinating earrings. These are super blue, super cute in blue, and they're kind of a mirrored blue. So they are extra gorgeous. This is a longer necklace. And then look at this tassel on the end. Now you have that large blue multifaceted stone. Also has that reflection going on. And y'all, it's actually dark at the top and then it gets translucent at the bottom. I don't know if, if you guys will be able to see that on camera, but you can see as you get closer to the bottom of the stone, it's much more clear and kind of has a gray look. It is absolutely gorgeous in blue and in silver. Super cute. I'm going to put it on a short bust so you can really take a look at what that tassel looks like on that necklace. Absolutely gorgeous. And then I paired it up with this cute blue and silver charm bracelet, y'all. And it has a two-inch extender with a lobster claw connector, so it's going to fit larger and smaller wrists. But y'all, look at this. That is cute. And actually, this would be cute if you doubled it. But it's up to you. If you like the set, you can get one or multiples of the bracelet. I have plenty of these. Take a look at those two together, y'all. Really, really pretty in that blue. That is a gorgeous set in blue and in silver. And what did I do? I don't know what I did with the bag, y'all. Oh. See, this is also what happens when you got this much uh, right here. This much jewelry around you. Take a look at this set, y'all. $10 set. $5 for the necklace. $5 for the bracelet is a $10 set. This is going to be item number three. Item number three. If you want to grab this, comment number three set. You can always say number three necklace, number three bracelet, and again, number three set. Gorgeous in blue and silver. And y'all, I just cannot express to y'all how cute that charm is on that necklace. Number three. 
you want to grab that comment number three for me, and I will reserve it just for you. Number three. Number three. In blue and in silver. Let me put all these pieces together. So our next question is, which toy answered the user's questions with replies like, it's certain, reply hazy, try again. Which toy answered user's questions with, re with replies like, it's certain, or reply hazy, try again. Does that ring a bell with anybody? My mother would never let me buy one of these. So let's see if y'all get this right. Got you for 177 yellow, Rita. What do you guys think? All right, so we looked at green. Let's look at and let's look at something else yellow, y'all. I believe I have two of this necklace remaining, but I have several of the earrings and the bracelet that I'm going to show with it. Super cute. And y'all, this is a great day to do some of your holiday shopping online, completely safe, absolutely affordable. All of the items I'm showing you today are 100% nickel and lead free. And the item, most of the items that I'm showing you are $5. I'm going to show you some kids' items because I promised Tiffany I was going to show her some kids' items. And so we're going to throw in some kids' items in just a little bit because I want to make sure I get those in for her. Of course, I don't have cool kids cam with me today, y'all. She catching up on her brother, catching up on homework today. So take a look at these chain earrings. You got it right, Lene, the magic eight ball. You are absolutely right. Take a look at these chain earrings on silver hardware as a two inch extender, as this tiny serpentine chain. So you can't wear it any shorter. This is a longer necklace, y'all, but she is super cute and yellow. Now I do also have this in a really bright green. But you got this teardrop shaped pendant with that uh, silver beading around that pendant, super cute in yellow. And then take a look at these teardrop silver earrings that I paired with this. Absolutely gorgeous. Silver hardware on a silver fish hook. Super cute. And then I got this cute, stretchy silver bracelet. Also cute. It has lots of medallions and charms on it. It is a stretchy, so it's going to fit larger and smaller wrists. Super cute with the bracelet. Pull this up again. Absolutely gorgeous, y'all. And then lastly, I have this cute silver beaded yellow earring. I mean, ring. It is a stretchy. It's going to fit sizes 6 to 11. Has that same style beading as the pendant. This is a gorgeous $20 set. Need to grab something for that sister of yours that has everything. What a cute set for Christmas. I only have one of these little rings, y'all, but I have plenty of everything. Well, I have plenty of the bracelet and earrings. I have two of this necklace. Two of the necklace, one of the ring, plenty of the necklace and earrings. If you're looking for a complete $20 set, comment number 19 for me. Number 19 for me. And I will reserve it just for you. Number 19. Or you can say number 19 necklace, number 19 earrings number 19 bracelet, or number 19 set. Number 19, absolutely gorgeous, in yellow and in silver. Number 19. And again, I also have this necklace in green. Number 19.
Let me write down Lene's point. 19. All right. Oh, I love this next question. Name the handheld slide viewer that allow users to look at 3D images on paper disc. Name the handheld viewer that allow users to look at 3D images on paper disc. All right. Y'all, this particular bracelet is so bright and it is so cute. I have three of these. Take a look at this two, four. There are seven of these little beaded, bright yellow bracelets. They are stretchy and they have this little silver bar on it. Super cute. Absolutely gorgeous in yellow. Super bright yellow. Gorgeous. This is going to be Number 92, number 92. If you want to grab this bracelet, comment number 92 for me, and this will be reserved just for you. Number 92 in yellow. Number 92. Bright, bright yellow. Oh, Lene beat you again, Rita. Yes, a view master is correct. So Renee has two points, Rita has one point. View master is the correct answer. This cute, cute set in blue, another blue and silver set, y'all. Um, I don't know that I even have anything blue with gold hardware. But blue and silver just seems to be a natural match. Now, this particular necklace, I'm going to show you. I also have it in red. So this set would completely work in red as well. Take a look. Now, I take that back. The red necklace is a little bit different than this. But this is one of those 36-inch well, that didn't work out so good. Let me connect it back. Hold on one second, y'all. But this particular necklace would also work as a belt. It is so cute. Sorry about that. Put that back on the... This would be a super cute belt, y'all, on like a nice little sweater dress. This would be super cute. You could use it, rock it with a maxi dress in the summertime, a sweater dress in the wintertime. Look at the length of this, y'all. For, for a lot of these screens, it's longer than that. This is a 36-inch uh, necklace, so you could wear it as a super long necklace. And the thing about it is, if your waist is a little, and actually 38 inches, it has a 2-inch extender on it. If your waist is bigger than 38 inches, you can go to Michael's, Joanne's, wherever, and you can get some chain like this, and you can extend it out really, really easy. But y'all, this is super cute. She comes with the complimentary blue stone earrings, kind of an aquamarine blue. Take a look at that. Super cute in that beautiful light blue. Some of these are tear, teardrop shapes. Some of these are round. They kind of alternate. You could also double this up and wear it this length, super cute. And I'm gonna actually show it on the bust like that. There's also some emerald cuts on. So you got teardrop, you got round, and you got emerald cut. Take a look at that necklace, y'all. Super cute and blue and silver. Again, you could easily wear it as a belt. And I paired up these cute silver earrings with this necklace. Absolutely gorgeous in silver and in blue. And then I have this blue, I'm sorry, this silver cuff bracelet. Take a look at that. It is a cuff bracelet. Your wrist is a little larger. You can pull it open. 
if it's a little smaller, you can squeeze it in. Super cute in silver. I also have this bracelet in gold. Take a look. It has that hammered metal finish at the top. And then it has those brushed lines at the bottom. Super cute cuff bracelet, y'all. Yeah. And again, I also have the bracelet in gold. And then I have this cute silver ring, y'all. She's cute. Stretchy back, fit size is 6 to 11. This is a gorgeous four-piece set, $20. Take a look. $5 for the bracelet, $5 for the necklace, $5 for the earrings, and $5 for the ring. A $20 set. If you want to grab this, comment number 173 for me. And I will reserve it just for you. Hey, Sharon, thank you for joining. We're on all day today. Number 173. Super cute in blue and in silver. Number 173. And if you just want the bracelet, you can comment 173 bracelet. Or you can say 173 necklace, earrings, or ring. However you like to match these up. Number 173 in blue and in silver. Now, again, I have the ring and the bracelet, also in gold hardware. So if you like this and you prefer it in gold, we can do that as well. Make sure I got the right bag here, y'all. Yeah. Number 173. So our next question is, which sound system required the use of large rectangular tape cartridges. Which sound system in the 70s, y'all, required, and I got a story to go with this, and required the use of large rectangular tape cartridges. So y'all, this gorgeous necklace that I'm about to show you is absolutely beautiful. And once again, my red bracelet are completely out of reach. And I have this necklace also in a deep sapphire blue. Yes, Lene, A-Track. A-Track is the right answer. So y'all, when I was growing up in the 70s, my daddy had a Buick, Buick 227 deuce and a quarter. Or two was it 225? Now I'm, I'm thinking 227. 225. It was burgundy and it had a black rag top with black leather seats. And the A track player was underneath the dash on the front seat. And that's when kids could ride on the front seat and didn't nobody think anything about it. As a matter of fact, I don't think we even had four seat belts uh, during that time period either. And uh, I can remember as a little girl, he used to tell me because it was under the dash on the passenger side. And he would tell me, you know, go to the next song. And I would take my foot, take my big toe and change the eight track to the next track to play the next song. And that was my greatest memory about that car. <laughs> and then I can remember as a kid, uh, he and his lifelong friend Randolph Grimes, Tracy, he had two sons, Tracy and Keevy, and we would always be on the back seat. Randolph and Daddy be in the front seat. And they both had these huge afros, y'all, but they were perfect. I mean, just perfect. And he pat and pat that thing in the mirror to get that, get it perfect. And when we would all ride together as kids, we sit on the back seat and play with the power windows because again, power windows. You know, now I don't know that you can buy a car with manual windows anymore. I don't even know if they sell them that way. But uh, we would play with the power windows until we blow the fuse in the 70s. <laughs> then we get chewed out because then none of the windows in the car worked until they replaced the fuse underneath the dash on the driver's side. So I'll, th those are my favorite memories of. Uh... So, Rita, we doing 70s trivia. We doing 70s trivia. As a matter of fact, when we watched movies in the 70s, I don't know if kids remember this in school, it had the film strip. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't go to YouTube to watch a video, which I imagine that's what a lot of teachers use now. But we had the film strip, and then you had the cassette. 
that you would play along with the film strip. The film, it wasn't animated or nothing. It was just still pictures. But um, everybody wanted to be the kid that would advance the film strip when the cassette would beat. They tell the story and then it beat. Then you go to the next frame. Uh, or am I telling my age? Because maybe some of y'all are too young to remember that. But I, those are my memories of the 70s. Anyway, enough reminiscing. So this cute red necklace, y'all, and I also have this in a sapphire blue, super cute, has these cute little rhinestone, clear rhinestone earrings on a silver fish hook. You got a two-inch extender. You can see how long this is. Look at this pendant on this necklace, y'all. It is super cute and red with, clear, with that clear rhinestone cap. Absolutely gorgeous, y'all. Super cute. Sharon, you remember the film strips? Y'all remember the film strips? Super cute, y'all, in red with those clear rhinestones. Absolutely gorgeous. And take a look at that. Oh, yeah, Rita. Oh, yeah. And who would have ever thought that Blockbusters would have went out of business, y'all? I just, you know, in the 90s, I thought Blockbusters be around forever. Take a look at this necklace, y'all. Super cute and red. And again, I have this in sapphire blue. Absolutely gorgeous. This is number 193. Number 193 in red. 193. 193 in red. You want to grab that comment 193 for me? And I will reserve that just for you. So, this next necklace I'm going to show you is in orange. And how is that? Oh, these are a whole bag of these must be orange necklaces. I only have one of. Okay. So, these are one and done. I thought this necklace, y'all, was so beautiful when it came out, and I still think it's beautiful. And I have it. I also have this in a in a really neat white, and it transitions to clear. This is an acrylic necklace. Take a look at this, y'all. She is absolutely gorgeous in that beautiful bright orange. And y'all know the fall colors last year were that was was all the oranges and yellows. And we're seeing those again this year. This is two strands of acrylic beads in orange. She is absolutely beautiful. I only have one of these remaining. Has these acrylic bead earrings. Got these double strands of translucent to solid orange acrylic stones and beads. Super cute. And I know my children are downstairs doing their work. Right, children? I hear a whole lot of chatter, y'all. Check this out in orange, y'all. This is a beautiful necklace. I love this necklace. This was one of my favorites. And um, it also was available in a really bright blue. And I missed it. But um, I have one left in orange. She is super cute. This is number 58. Number 58. I only have one of these. Number 58. So if you want to grab that, comment 58 for me. And I will reserve just for you. Number 58 in acrylic orange. Super cute. All right. Let's go to our next question. Went with that necklace at the latest app, so I remember to uh, remember to put that all in there. All right, y'all. Let's see what our next question is going to be. So, speaking of jewelry, so in the seventies, this piece of jewelry was first introduced, and it included a liquid liquid crystal display technology. Think about it. This which piece of jewelry was introduced in the 70s and it included a liquid crystal display. 
as a part of the jury. Does that ring a bell with anybody? So this next necklace, I'm going to show y'all in red. And I have about five of these um, remaining. I thought I had one open. Maybe I, maybe I don't. And this piece of jewelry, y'all, you know, kind of told people how your day was going, if that gives you any type of hint. I really thought I had one of these open. I may be hanging on the board in the garage. Y'all, I still got jewelry in my garage from when I did an event down in Columbia at the beginning of the month, and it's almost first Friday again. Take a look at this gorgeous red necklace, y'all. Super cute. Has these red pearlized um, bead earrings. Absolutely gorgeous. Super cute in red. You got the large beads, the small beads, and the silver beads all mixed in on this necklace. But what type of jewelry, Lene? You're close. Take a look at that in red and Silver. And this is one you can wear pulled up as a choker. Yes, Rita. Rita beat you too, and you gave it a, you gave it away, Lene. A mood ring. Yes. So check a look, take a look at this, y'all, if you pull it up as a choker. Super cute. Super, super cute. I love this necklace. And because the silver beads are multifaceted, when the light hits it, you get reflections on those beads. This is another gorgeous Christmas piece in red. All of our reds and greens are gorgeous pieces for Christmas. And this is also a necklace, y'all, if you doubled her up. Let's take a look at what that looks like if you double this up. And maybe you wore two instead of one. Because this is the beaded necklaces, believe it or not, are so cute when you actually double them up. Let me show you what that looks like. So, Rita, you get that point. I think you and Lene are tied. Y'all, look at how that looks doubled up. Is that gorgeous or what? And it's already a very full necklace. And so when you double it up, look at how that looks. That is, so, and then you pull, if you pull them up just a little bit closer. Take a look at that, y'all. Absolutely gorgeous times two. You want this necklace? Comment number 105. If you want it times two, comment 105 times two. Super cute in red and in silver. Think about how you're going to look on Christmas Day with this cute necklace on. Number 105. And again, I have five, five or six of these. Number 105 in red and in silver. One, oh, five. And this necklace also come in white pearls as well. It's called Battle of the Bombshell. Super cute in red. All right. Let's look at, let's see. Let's go back to green. Now, I showed this last week, y'all, and I am so surprised that I still have this. I thought it was just really, really cute. But I actually still, I have two remaining. I thought I would sell out of this. I have two remaining of this necklace. It is in green. Again, perfect for the Christmas holidays. Y'all, it is a longer necklace. Super cute. It has these cute little, again, little clear rhinestone earrings on a silver fish hook. Got this medium sized chain. Let me see what kind of earring we can pop with this. Thing. I like these earrings. 
This, this, this necklace needs some earrings that's going to say, hey, I'm here. Take a look. This is a long, longer necklace. It has this large green oval stone surrounded by rhinestones. Look at that, y'all. That is absolutely gorgeous in green. Got you for 105 times two, Rita. Look at that, y'all. Absolutely gorgeous in green. I love, and I don't, I like green and I have some green pieces, but I don't have the right color green for this. And I even thought like with a white, y'all, yeah, so I ordered this white uh, sweater dress from one of my favorite stores. And so I cannot wait to get it. And I thought, oh, this necklace might look cute with it. That's how much I like this necklace. Look at it in green. Hey, kids, y'all are supposed to be working. I can hear y'all all the way up here, and I am live. All right, y'all. Take a look. Super cute. Green and clear rhinestone. And y'all, I only have one of these rings. Look at this ring with this necklace. And it is a stretchy back fit size. It's 6 to 11. And this is a good four-finger ring, y'all. Y'all disregard my ugly nails, but take a look at that ring. That's cute. And then even on your ring finger, this would look gorgeous. Take a look at that. That's popping, y'all. That is popping in that green and rhinestone. And then you got this large stone on this necklace. Look at those two, y'all. Super cute in green and rhinestone. And then I would upgrade because you can't wear those little bitty rhinestone earrings with this necklace. Mm -mm. Look at these, y'all. Look at all of that sparkle. Take a look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous in green and in rhinestone. Super cute. $15, y'all. This is a $15 set. It's right in in that beautiful red and green for Christmas. I don't know if you guys have seen this year is really popular is the Christmas plaid. You know, that red, green, and yellow plaid. With this, oh my gosh, it would be so cute on Christmas Day. And even though we may be doing a COVID Christmas, you need to be cute on your Zoom Christmas calls. You, you gotta be. If you wanna grab this set, I have plenty of the earrings, two of the necklaces, and one of the rings remaining. This is number 129, number 129. Now, if you want the full set, I only have one. If you like the necklace and the earrings, I have two. Or if you just like the earrings, I have plenty of the earrings. Number 129. Hey, Stacy, welcome back. Number 129 in green and rhinestone. And then this is also a perfect Christmas giveaway gift. Number 129 in green and rhinestone. I got to do a better job of keeping up with my bag, y'all. I took stuff out, man. I don't know what I did with the bag I took it out of. This is terrible. Okay. I mean, literally, I just took it out. The okay, we're not going to worry about it. I'm going to grab another bag and keep it moving. Number 129. Watch as soon as I... I have one more. Necklace in that bag. I'm going to write it in. We will run across it a little later. <laughs> All right. Green, y'all. Cute, cute, cute. Let's look at another orange piece. Now, this particular necklace, I have an orange, yellow, and in blue. And this, y'all, is such a cute piece. It's very simplistic. We're going to go ahead and ask our next question. Let me mark down Rita's point from the last one. Okay. Which popular 70s carpet? had long fibers and was used to cover everything from your house floors to the interior of your conversion van that you had in the 70s. 
What type of flooring carpet had long fibers and was used to cover everything from the floor of your home to the floor and the walls of your van? You got it, Stacy. Shag carpet is is Stacy is on the board. Stacy's on Instagram, y'all. You got it, Stacy. Shag carpet. Stacy got a point. So this necklace, y'all, has these cute chain earrings. It is a larger necklace, so you can wear this shorter or longer. It has a two-inch extender, so you can wear it longer than what's shown here. Super cute. This is it in orange, y'all. You have those cute leaves in orange. I also have this necklace in yellow and in blue and a baby blue, and a really soft, pretty yellow. Take a look at that. Gorgeous necklace. Again, got that cousin. She got everything. So what do you get her for Christmas? A really cute, subtle necklace like this. This is going to be number 187. Number 187. 187 in orange. 187. Again, orange, blue, and yellow are available. Number 187. My kids are so loud, y'all. And I know there's no way that they are working if they chatting that much. And my son got three, well, almost a month worth of math he needs to be doing. All right, let's switch to yellow. So this next set I'm going to show you. I don't think I'm going to show that. Oh, I love this necklace, y'all. And this is a one and done. This is the last one of these that I have. It is absolutely gorgeous in yellow. So the next question is, what was the name of the fashion footwear that had an average of two to five inch thick solid soles. What was the name of the fashion footwear that had an average of two to five inch thick solid soles? So these earrings y'all have this chain Fringe on a silver fish hook. Super cute. It is a longer necklace, and you can't wear this any shorter. It does have a two-inch extender, so if you're a little taller, you can wear this longer. Take a look at this pendant, y'all. This is a gorgeous, bright yellow stone in this necklace. It is gorgeous. Super bright. Check that out. I'm showing it to you on a shorter bust. So you can really see that. Oh, y'all coming back quick on Facebook now. Let's see. The answer is platforms. Lene gets the point. Platforms. Take a look at this necklace, y'all. Super cute in yellow. Lene takes the lead, y'all, with three points. Lene has three, Rita has two, and Stacy has one point. Super cute and yellow. I only have one of these remaining. This is a one and done. This is going to be number 68 in that beautiful yellow stone. Super cute for a turtleneck. Number 68. Number 68. If you want to grab that, comment number 68 for me and I will reserve it just for you. 
number 68. Number 68 in yellow. And again, I only have one of these remaining. Number 68. All right, let me get Renee's point. Y'all, I'm going to have bags everywhere by the time this day is over with. I took stuff out and then didn't put them back in, didn't add the bag in the bag. So when I get ready to, to uh, ship these out, I'm going to be lost. Okay. Y'all ready for the next one? People use phrases like 10-4, good buddy, when communicating on which radio system. They use phrases like 10 for good buddy when communicating on this type of radio system. Y'all, let's go back to blue. I've got this cute blue bracelet. I have three of these remaining. Take a look at this bracelet, y'all. Super cute. In blue and silver. This is a hinged bracelet. Check it out. It is absolutely gorgeous. You got that large oval stone in the center with those silver squares. Yes, yeah, Sharon, you get the point. CB radio with those silver squares on both sides. And then you have those smaller ovals to end it up. The, the band of the bracelet itself has that brush silver finish. Super cute. And it opens like this. Absolutely gorgeous. Has that brush band on the back. This is going to be number 34. Number 34. So we got about 10 more minutes left on this show. And then I believe the next show is all about magnificent music, y'all. We're going to be looking at coppers, golds, gun medals. It's going to be super fun. Magnificent Musings is one of my favorites. So Sharon has earned a point. I have a lot of blue over here, y'all. Oh, this little necklace is so cute. All right, y'all. Let's see if y'all remember this. Which teardrop-eyed child figures appeared on cards and also became collectible figurines during the 70s? Does that ring a bell with anybody? Teardrop-eyed Child figures appeared on cards and also became a collect became collectible figurines. So y'all take a look at this beautiful necklace. This is so cute. You know, do you have um, that preteen niece or daughter in your family? Take a look. You got these cute clear rhinestone earrings. Take a look at that cute stone. With those small rhinestones, this is perfect for that tween or preteen. You don't want to get her something too adult. This is a super cute necklace for somebody like that. Absolutely gorgeous. I have several of these remaining. I think four or five of these. This is a cute, cute stocking stuffer for that special niece or daughter. Absolutely gorgeous, y'all. In blue. No, not trolls. Teardrop eyed child figures appeared on cards, like greeting cards, and then became collectible figurines. Take a look, number 154. This necklace is number 154. 
you want to grab this, comment 154 for me, and I will reserve it just for you, number 154. One fifty four. Yep, Lene, precious moments is the correct answer. You earn another point. So I'm going to show some kids items, y'all. The question is, where is my kids? Oh. Okay, y'all. Okay, y'all, give me one quick second. My kid stuff was way out in the hallway. <laughs> So these first little earrings I'm going to show you guys are these cute little flower petal earrings. They are super cute. I have these in pink, clear rhinestone, blue, and in green. These are so cute. These are $1. All of our kids' earrings are $1. Take a look at those. This is it in, in Future Pink. And again, I also have these in blue, rhinestone, purple, and green. Super cute. Also in clear. Absolutely gorgeous. If you like these earrings, comment number 191. 191 for those. Super cute. Number 191 on those cute little earrings. Actually, I don't need another bag for those. I just need to do this. 191. And again, we have blue and green, clear and purple. And then the fuchsia pink, number 191. Hey, Nikki. Thank you for joining again. And then I wanted to make sure I showed these little cutie pies, y'all. These were so cute. If I can quit dropping them. So, y'all, Nikki is my business partner in Chicago, and Nikki shows a very cute jewelry. The thing about paparazzi is. Um, consultants tend to have different inventory, so if you get a chance to support Nikki, please do check out her live shows. Christmas time is the perfect time for paparazzi earrings. Now, I'm gonna tell y'all about these little cuties right here. These little earrings, even though they are designed for children, I love little earrings like this for the second hole that I have in my ear. These little cuties are one dollar. This is an iridescent. So all of these are iridescent. So I have this larger circle. And then there is a pair that are butterflies that are super cute. Let me show you these. Also $1. Super cute and butterflies. So if you like those, you can comment number... Grab a number. 184. You can say large circle. You can say butterflies. And then they have some cute little bars. And then there's a much smaller circle as well. These are the little bars. With the three little iridescent stones in it. Again, this is going to be 184. You can say 184 bars. 
and then I have um, hearts and then the small circle. And that's going to be number 184. And you can see these are our smaller little stud. Super cute. And then there are some hearts. And let me show you the hearts. And these little earrings you can wear with any color because they have that iridescent finish on them. Super cute and hard. And like I said, the little round ones I stick in the second hole on my ear. So again, this is going to be number 184. And you can say large circle, small circle, bars, butterflies, and hearts. Number 184. Number 184. And let's see what else we got in here. Oh, these little earrings I thought were so cute too. Now these, um, let's see, they show through the bag. They do okay. So these I have in stars, blue stars. And then I have copper circles. Oops, copper circles. And then silver triangles. Cute little silver triangles. And these are nice size earrings. Silver triangles, great for everyday wear. Again, these are $1. And pink hearts. Take a look at those pink hearts. Pink hearts. All right. If you like those, you can comment number 87. Number 87. Again, I have copper circles, pink hearts, blue stars, and silver triangles. Number 87. Super cute. They're $1 per pair. And, and I bought a lot of these, y'all. <laughs> these little cuties come in pink, clear, blue, green, and purple. And all these are little stud earrings. They are super cute. And again, I, I really gravitated to these, y'all, because Cameron loses earrings like everything and so at a dollar a pair um i used to always try to get the little board with multiple pairs of earrings in. and she's gotten better as she's gotten older but when she was little and she wore earrings it was just you know known i was gonna that she was gonna probably come home with just one if any so this one's gonna be number 124 so at a dollar a pair again these are absolutely cute stocking stuffers um also have some rings let me show you guys a few rings that we have. And these are super cute little rose rings. The rings for the little girls are adjustable. Those are a dollar as well. These rose rings I have in peach, gray, white, purple, pink, and black. The one at the top is actually a black rose. So peach, pink, white, purple, and black. Super cute. Hey, Judy, thank you for joining. I am doing an all-day Good Friday Live. So please jump in and jump out throughout the day. I'm going to be showing all kinds of jewelry. Number 194. Again, the little kids rings, kids jewelry is $1 per item. Number 194 for those rings. Just to specify the color that you are interested in. Let's see what other rings. Yeah, like, um, then I'll show you guys a few bracelets. And these little butterflies were so cute. Um, when I was down in Columbia, uh, little girls just love to have their own little bling. Look at those. Super cute butterfly rings. They are completely adjustable. You can see I have uh, seven of those remaining. They're $1 each. So there's a solid pink ring, 
um, there's pink with the look pink at the top. The top wings are pink. The bottom ones are iridescent. The top wings on this are pink with a blue at the bottom. And then that's also pink with iridescent. Super cute. This is going to be number 23. And again, these are $1 each for the little iridescent butterfly rings. Super cute. $1 for those. And then let's look at a couple of bracelets. This bracelet, y'all, I just fell in love with this. And it would be really cute with the um, butterfly ring that I just saw. So that you got these moonstone beads. Cute little stretchy bracelets for little girl with a little butterfly pendant on it. And this is it in blue. In blue. And I also have yellow, green, purple, and pink. Yellow, blue, green, purple, and pink in this one. Take a look at those. Super cute. Absolutely gorgeous. Again, those are $1. Just specify the, the color that you like. And this is going to be number 79. Cute stocking stuffers for that little girl that you're thinking about for Christmas. You can fill her stocking with little cute pieces of jewelry. Think about it. For five bucks, you can get five cute little items to put into her Christmas stocking. Number 79. You wanna grab those, just specify the color and I will be glad to reserve those just for you. Number 79. All right. I have lots of kids items. If you check out my website, plcbodybling.com and you scroll down and click on cool kids, you can see a lot of the kids items that I that I have. Got you for the butterfly ring and the butterfly bracelet, Stacy. Super cute. All right. And then, okay, I'm gonna show you guys this bracelet right quick. And then we're gonna drop off and get ready for our magnificent musings show. This little bracelet, I think, is so adorable as well. And this one comes in I have a multicolor of blue and purple and then I have a solid blue and a solid purple remaining in these let me show you this one this is such a cute little little bracelet for that special girl in your life to take a look at this one this one's going to be number 161 Look at that cute little bracelet with those moonstones you got the large and the small ones it is a stretchy as well and so you can get this multicolor or you can get blue or you can get pink. Super cute. One dollar, y'all. Super cute. This is one sixty one. So today's winner of the 70s trivia is Lene. And Lene, you squeeze back because Rita was on you, girl. And then Sharon and Stacy showed up and was ready to play as well. But Lene uh, walks away with the free prize. She has four points. Thank you guys so much for playing today. Thank you so much for purchasing. And thank you for sharing the video. I will be back shortly with the Magnificent Musing Show. We're going to have copper items, gunmetal items, uh, some brass items. You will really enjoy this show. And it, and it probably will be more like 145, y'all, because uh, I got to get some of this organized. I keep opening and opening jewelry and I'm slowly closing myself in. So I got to get some of this cleaned up quickly and then pull the items for the next show. So we'll be back at 145 for our magnificent musing show. Thank you so much. And thanks again for joining and shopping.